16 1 write the number of significant figures in the following a 0 0.0052 answer 2 b 126.000 answer 3 2 distinguish between homogeneous and heterogeneous mixtures answer Mixtures having same composition throughout are called homogeneous mixtures. Here, the components completely mix with each other. Example, air, all solutions. Mixtures having different composition at different parts are called heterogeneous mixtures. Here, the components do not completely mix with each other. Example, muddy water, sea water, etc. 17. A compound contains 4.07% hydrogen, 24.27% carbon, and 71.65% chlorine. Its molar mass is 98.96 gram. What are its empirical and molecular formulas? Answer. The given value of percentage of carbon is 24.27. Atomic mass of carbon is 12. Our next step we want to find the relative number of atom. To find that we want to divide percentage divided by atomic mass. So the relative number of atom of carbon is 2.02. .02. To find the symbol ratio we want to take the least number of relative number of atom and divide it with the relative number of atom. So the symbol ratio is 1 and the simplest whole number ratio is 1. By doing this way, we get percentage of hydrogen as 4.07, atomic mass 1, relative number of atom 4.07, symbol ratio 2, simplest to whole number ratio 2, and percentage of chlorine 71.65, atomic mass 35.5, and the relative number of atoms is 2.02, .02, symbol ratio 1, simplest to whole number ratio 1. So the empirical formula is CH2Cl. Empirical formula mass is equal to 12 plus 2 plus 35.5 equal to 49.5. Molecular mass is given that is 98.96. So N is equal to molecular mass divided by empirical formula mass. So N is equal to 2. Molecular formula is equal to empirical formula into N that is CH2Cl into 2 molecular formula is equal to C2H4Cl2 18. What are the observations made by Rutherford in the alpha particle scattering experiment? Answer. Most of the alpha particles passed through the gold foil without any deviation. A small fraction of the alpha particles was deflected by small angles. A very few alpha particles bounded back, that is, were deflected by nearly 180 degree. 19. 1. Draw the boundary surface diagram of 2px orbital. Two. How many unpaired electrons are present in nitrogen item and name the rule in determining it? Answer. There are three unpaired electrons in nitrogen atom and the rule behind this is Hunt's rule of maximum multiplicity. 21. Define electron gain enthalpy. Answer. It is the enthalpy change when an electron is added to the outermost shell of an isolated gaseous atom. 2. Chlorine has high negative value of electron gain enthalpy than fluorine. Explain. Answer. This is because when an electron is added to fluorine, it enters into the smaller second shell. Due to the smaller size, the electron suffers more repulsion from other electrons. But for chlorine, the incoming electron go to the larger third shell. So the electronic repulsion is low and hence chlorine adds electron more easily than fluorine. 21. 1. What is meant by diagonal relationship? Answer. The similarities in property shown by a diagonally placed elements on the second and third periods in the modern periodic table are called diagonal relationship. 
2. The elements of the second period in the periodic table shows anomalous properties. Give reason. Answer. The anomalous properties are due to their small size, large charge to radius ratio, high electronegativity and absence of vacant d orbital. 22. Write the postulates of VSEPR theory. Answer. The shape of a molecule depends on the number of valence shell electron pair around the central atom. The valence shell electron pair repel each other. To reduce the repulsion, the electron pairs stay at maximum distance. Presence of lone pairs of electron causes distortion in the expected geometry of the molecule. 23. 1. Define lattice enthalpy. Answer. Lattice enthalpy is the energy required to completely separate one mole of an ionic compound into corresponding gaseous ion. 2. The resultant dipole moment of NH3 is greater than that of NF3, in spite of higher electronegativity of fluorine atom explained. Answer. This is because in NH3, the orbital dipole due to the lone pair is the same direction as the resultant dipole moment of the three NH bonds. But in NF3, the orbital dipole is in the opposite direction of the resultant dipole moment of the three NF bonds. So the dipole moment get particularly cancelled.